Corey here, Canadian RC guy. Well, we're back, and if you can see on the table, we got ourselves a new RC. So let's get this camera turned around, and I'll show you what we got. Here's our new D42 from WPL. We've decided to go with something a little different this time. Two-wheel drive. Time to get her lowered down. Turn ourselves into a little drift van. Give me a second, I'll get the camera set up, and we'll go over this thing a little bit better. So here it is. Our D42, soon to be Drift Taxi Van. Got a little bit of upgrades to do. Of course, we'll order everything from the WPL store like we always do. Don't forget to use our code, CanadianRCGuy, when you order. Save yourself 3%. We'll drop the link in the comments. So, let's get into this beautiful van. So we jumped ahead, we got everything on. We did our decals, wipers, mirrors, all that kind of stuff already. Um, it's obviously leaf springs in the back, independent suspension in the front, just a two wheel drive. So I think it's gonna be good for what we wanna do. Um, we do have some other more uh, decals on order so we can make it a little more taxified. Um, it should be pretty good. I'll get the camera a little bit better and we can show underneath that kind of stuff. We'll talk about the suspension and the drivetrain. Then we'll head outside and see what this thing can do. So here it is a little bit closer. They are well put together little vehicles. So I mean, that's why I keep going back to WPL. Love the decals. So underneath you can see front independent suspension. Obviously we'll be going with the full metal upgrade kit. And then back here, sorry. Just got a rear axle on leaf springs. And I hear uh, if you get rid of the pins and change them over to screws, you get a little bit of a better flex, works a little bit better. So that's definitely something we're gonna do in the future as well. Of course, upgrade to the metal drive shaft. Obviously, we order from the WPL store. Make sure you do too. So I think, oh, obviously we'll get this thing turned on and we'll show you that on here get ourselves on here so here i'll just uh flip it over for a second so you can see the steering angle and then if you click on the button on the top of the the remote you get tw about twice the steering angle out of this thing and i hear with the kit you can get quite a bit more so this should be good and as well it's got a throttle button on it you can click it once, and it just puts it into like a high speed, click it again, puts it into a lower speed. Pretty simple design. That's WPL. So we'll get this thing uh, finished charged up. We're going to head outside. Like I said, we've got a uh, pavement driveway we can rip around in, and then our other driveway is gravel. So don't forget, if you're not a subscriber, hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and drop us a comment on what you want to see us do to this van. We definitely have more decals coming to turn it a little more into a taxi. And uh, let us know what else you want us to buy. Maybe test it on the channel. So we'll be back in a second and we'll be ripping around outside. Before we head outside, just a quick little update. If you watched our last video, we did this wood stove here from Princess Auto. We've got her installed in the shop. It's like 20 degrees in here. Outside, it's about two degrees and dreary rain. You'll see when we head outside to drive this new van. But yeah, this is definitely going to do the trick. Keep us warm all winter and to let it keep us uh, doing our RCs. So let's head outside. Just wanted to stop the video for a minute and say, hey, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Because remember, at 500 subscribers, we're giving away a C24. And at 1,000 subscribers, we're giving away a C54. So share this video to your friends. Let's start climbing. So here we go. We'll give her a little rip out here in the driveway. Huh. She's, uh, because of being slick out here, she'll at least let me do some donuts. Oh. Uh, tried her in slow speed. Not quite, quite as good. Yeah, not bad. She's a pretty quick little thing. Oh. 
Not bad. We'll get some uh, less grippy tires on her and I bet you she'll, she'll do a lot better. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Turn the steering down a little bit. She, uh, she definitely wants to grab when it's got full, full turn. We'll need some uh, tinier tires. I, uh, pretty quick though. We'll, uh, we'll head over to the grass here. See how it does there. Then we'll head over to the gravel. I bet you she'll do some good donuts there. This thing will go through the grass or not being just two wheel drive. Oh, uh, not really. Maybe if it was a little drier. She definitely struggles, that's for sure. Hurry, right, we turn the steering down a little bit. That does it a little bit better. She just, oh, I think we, I think we're stuck. Yeah, I think that's about it for our grass adventure. Oh, there we go, we got out of it. Oh. She just gets uh, high center too easy. Oh, we'll head over to the gravel there and see what it She just kind of digs in and away she goes. Definitely have to do something with tires there. It's just front suspension because she kind of, the tires hit and they just want to dig right in. But you turn the steering down a little bit and she does okay. Oh, stop for some reason here. I guess we'll have to take it inside and see what's going on. Well, we're back inside the shop. Not exactly sure what went on outside, but we dropped her on the table and everything's doing what it should be doing. So we'll just assume that was a little glitch. Uh, so I guess we'll save it. We'll get another better video, longer video outside, ripping it around again. We'll save that for the next. Then after that, we'll be an upgrade video. So don't forget, like I said, hit that subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up. Any comments, drop them down below on what you want to see us do to it or what you want to see us get next. And uh, don't forget, when you order from the WPL official store, use the code CanadianRCGuy. We'll drop a link in the comments. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you again soon. We figure we should end off with a nice little burnout video. No problem. Have to get ourselves some nice uh, slippier tires. Once again, thanks. We'll see you again soon. Leave some good little marks there. I'm not sure if you can see them. Right in there.